Okay, let's finish this. So, my job is to delete all of the hacknet files off of this server. As soon as we click this button, it's go time. You're gonna need a few uh, shells set up to make this less hectic. Because it's pretty hectic if you're just doing it regularly. But I'm gonna give you some info that'll make it not so hectic. Like the firewall password. So let's click the button. And we're in. So we just have to wipe everything. It's yeah, just get everything gone. Don't even worry about what's in here. Just click all the all the folders. Did I do that one? There we go. And once they're empty, you don't even need to check if you've done it right. It's good. DZ, you're done. And so it ends. Now we wait for another email. Here we go. So this is explained in, in one or two places, but basically port hack relies on a lovely little server to do its magic. And if you probe this, got nothing. So you just run this and watch. Hi, my name's Bit, and if you're hearing this, I'm already dead. It also means 
Hordak heart stopped, and my scripts worked. Which means we're finished. Which means you've done it. Doing this now was our last chance, I think. While they're in a rush to finish it all, and not under the eyes of the whole world yet. So, thanks. Thanks. If all's gone right, there's just one copy of Hacknet left to delete. And you're looking at it. This is why you keep multiple redundant backups. Kind of a flawed ending there. Oh, we deleted their backup, but why wouldn't they have multiple backups? On tape. Need to be able to skip these codes. Congratulations, you've done it. Here's a link to the credits, uh, which I already had open for reasons I will not go into. Here was this. Which has some cool stuff on it. If you can bother cracking into that, I won't do that. Has a bunch, bunch of tools on it. Um, some other stuff. Text files you may want to read. I won't spoil all of that. And that's the end of the game, essentially. Congratulations, you've done it.